New Year everybody and welcome back to my container garden. Haven't been around for a while due to my hard drive giving up and me having to re-record a lot of the footage, but I am here right now. Apologies for not having my usual intro of action, but I didn't want you to wait any longer. I have a new addition to my collection and it's the avocado plant. I love avocados, haven't got a clue where this plant is going to go but I'm having an exciting time trying to grow one. As you saw the start from my last video, my lemon plants are continuing to grow really well. After a shaky start, my turmeric has been repotted and I've got a first leaf. I had to replace some of my lemongrass and right now they're doing particularly well. potatoes aren't doing particularly well and they seem to have died off they clearly know it's winter because it's definitely not down to water and warmth they've also had a particularly bad problem with fungus gnats my cankerbush bush was doing really well and then I decided to put it by the window and I think it got about of the spider mites on it and it is died. I also started chitting some potatoes. It might be really early, it might be really late, but I'm gonna go for it, I'm gonna plant them out and I'll see what happens. My chia seeds and my mullein seeds are doing great at the moment they're in a propagator and i will leave them there for another couple of weeks we also have a new edition of the passion fruit it's an african variety and i will keep you up to date with its progress my chili, chamomile and empezote have not survived and even my bay leaf plant is looking worse for wear. outside have survived very well even through the snow. Oh yes, and my one kale plant. My shadow Benny is doing really well even being outside in the shed. And my Swiss shard and spinach are doing particularly well in these cooler weathers. are doing okay even with the infestation of springtails and I'm not too sure what happened to these last batch. These are actually my new strawberry runners. 
this is my garlic and I'm not too sure why they're starting to turn brown but I'm sure we'll find out well I hope you've enjoyed this video and you will continue to follow me and see what's happening with my plants please subscribe to this channel hit the bell so you get the updates as soon as they happen and I hope to see you again very soon thank you guys subscribe